Hey, what's going on guys? Panthex here, playing some Hearthstone. Gonna be playing with a priest deck that I've been playing recently. I wanted to show it to you guys, and I'm sure you've seen it among all the pros. All, some, maybe not all, maybe none. Um, but it's a priest deck that is an OTK deck related with the Xerx Cloning Gallery card. I'm gonna show you guys the list right now. I call it Start Small, because you gotta start with small cards anyway. Um, meaning the Xerx Cloning Gallery, making minions 1-1 one, one copies. Hey guys, if you haven't seen it already. Xerx Cloning Gallery, it's a witch, uh, not witch, witch a Boomsday legendary spell for a priest. Uh, so I'm going to 1-1 one, one copy of each minion in your deck. Uh, the deck list is right here, and I'm going to post a deck code in the comments below. Um, I run with no one cost minions, but a one cost power word shield, two of them. And basically, the way I want to run early game is that I defend my board as much as possible with Painted Zealot or Blood Mage Thalnos um, in case I have any aggro in the beginning. But I can hold off until turn five or six, depending on what turn I'm starting off of. Um, because I can take aggro damage and hopefully heal it up, depending on if I draw my Spirit Lashes. Um, so that I can start pulling out my late game cards like Shadow Essence, um, Prophet Bellin if I get to summon him, uh, or any of these other cards. But, and Dark Zoning Gallery by turn 9 is a very good card to have, um, but it depends on what cards you pull. Eternal Servitude and One Vivid Nightmare are my go-to cards, just so I can run OTK combos. Um, and in late game, hopefully in control scenarios, I'll be able to run Lesser Diamond Spellstone in the case of an emergency. So I'm going to show it to you guys. I'm going to run at least one, two, maybe even three duels, depending on the longevity of it. But we're going to see how it goes. I'm a rank 19 player, so I'm not up there in the ladder. But I do have a lot of knowledge. I do watch a lot of um the pros play i just don't take the game as seriously as i'd like to uh because i like playing joke Anduin decks uh this Uther. is one of my more serious decks though hopefully this aggro pally the doesn't hold me down too hard victory. but i am going to take away these two cards and hopefully pull out all right blood mage Thalnos is a good card to start out with just in case i pull spirit lash but i'm keeping radiant elemental as a board buffer um just in case, oh, it's not even an odd paladin. Interesting. Don't expect the best cards um, out of me or rank 19 players. Secret, turn one. Well met. I'm assuming it's repentance. Not repentance. I'm gonna put out that so I can get some card draw going. I already played secret on turn one. Kinda interesting. This is like a secret paladin? what he does. Has anyone ever found a secret for the Witcher expansion? Um, of the, the board, I mean. I haven't found it yet. Turn a minion back to, with one health. Well, kind of a bad play to use that with the Silverhand Recruit, but I guess he's keeping it as a board buffer himself. Maybe he might... Put something on it to... Like a security, in a way. Down the bells times two. I mean, I don't mind. Whatever. That's, that's not bad. Um... If you just spent four mana buffing one minion, I'm going to dispel it. It's still there on board, but I have Lyra next turn. Hopefully he doesn't kill it next turn, depending on what he does with this turn. If he blessings of kings, I'm probably not going to summon Lyra, though. So unfortunately, I drew up most of my combo pieces already. Uh, Prophet Villain and Maligos. We're gonna play. We're gonna play this where um, 
I play tempo instead of late game. He's pretty much taking a sweet time, isn't he? This is a bot. Let Probably not. me think. So yeah, I like this expansion so far. Um, I pretty much play mostly off of the... Oh, That's not good. Hmm. Good I pull from this. Charge Devil Sword. Not bad. Um, I'm not really scared of the Lyra. I'm just gonna hit this. Okay. Guess he'll kill it, but not a big deal in my opinion. Unless he's running more secrets and he just starts generating cards. It's just like not a deal. Because I don't want to hit it and then just have a one mana minion kill me. Follow the rule. Okay. Fine. Drawing two? Yeah, he's drawing two. It's an arcane intellect. A good turn for me to summon Prophet no, Bell. No. No. Just play it on tempo, then I'll play Barge Devil Sword next turn. Derek's will play in turn nine. Actually, I wonder. Hmm. Do I play Zarek's turn nine? Because I lost Mali. No, there's um. No, there isn't. A radiant elemental, two tainted zealots. I think that's... and then one charge double sword. Interesting. Why would you do that? That doesn't make any sense to me. Killing it? Please tell me you're gonna hit it with your face. That would be pretty good. For me, at least, I mean. You're hitting it with your face. Not sure if that was a play, buddy. So, I think this play is better here. Job's done. You know, that wasn't that good. No. I'm trying to get the Lesser Diamond Spellstone charges up here. It's not bad, honestly, because I got 7 mana worth of minion back. Um, but it also isn't the good. Ooh, Topsy Turvy. Alright, so he's actually, this is actually pretty scary for me. <laughs> oh well. I wonder if... Okay, so he's definitely killing that. I can kill the Lyra with, um... I don't have two, two charged double swords. I don't have any spells for that. So I'm gonna kill this up now, actually. The charge Devil Souls on my deck as, a, as like a second lane condition. It's more of a resurrection kind of thing. Oh wow. Oh wow.
That's cool and all. But I hope you guys enjoy more of those cards in your deck. Um, By the holy light. We'll take a vivid nightmare. It's one of my co uh, combo cards. Because it doesn't spit out the cards; it spits out copies. So that means he's generating, he's putting more into his deck. Reporting for duty. It's a manipulator, though. That was a, that was a card that uh, really threw me off there. All one cost cards. That means both minions and spells. It's a good card. I kind of gave him how many? Oh, just one. I gave him an additional one cost card. That's fine. Reporting for duty. If he adds four damage, that'll be ten. 12, 19, he's mm. one off lethal. So I need, play this. I need to buff this up. I have to kill one of these minions to heal. I want him to, I want to reduce his damage output right now. If he doesn't kill this this turn, I actually win because I have Vivid Nightmare and then Mind Blast to destroy him. Let me because think. this would be a copy of the of the Charge Devil Sword is then another five one, and then I have five damage from Mind Blast. Really. You know, I might be screwed here, and that's okay. He missed out on two damage. Oh, guess what? I win, guys. I know why. Because now I've got Prophet Velen. I've got my Vivid Nightmare, which I can copy Prophet Velen. Not all and then my Mind Blast is buffed. 20 damage. But I got lucky there. I got pretty lucky. Well played. That felt good. I was I was scared. My heart was beating for a second. Damn. All right, we'll go into another duel. Whew! I need some water after that one. See, the reason why I was scared is because I was afraid that I wouldn't pull Prophet Velen. Um, and that would mean like I'll be maybe one or two damage off of people. But I was successful. Shall bring victory. I'm gonna keep this hand. One. Uh, one, because that's a hunter, and two, uh, Radiant Elemental with Power Word Shields. It's a great combo because your spells cost one less. They draw uh, a card for free, basically, uh, with Power Word Shield, and it's 2 5 on board. So, no odd hunter here. Don't know his archetype. A lot of secret hunters have been played lately with uh, the card Secret Plan, but he doesn't have anything. So that means I've got this going out for free. Job's done. Okay, we pull out Cloning Gallery. Let's see if we pull out any other cards that we really don't want. I don't want Velen and Maligos um, pulled out with before turn 8 or 9. But we shall see what happens. We've got nothing early, so this is going to be good for me. But I can start generating. 
um, value. I don't want to draw cards. But I want to do this. I want to pull out Mind Blast. If push comes to shove, I'll use Master Spell next turn, but I don't want to use any more Power Word Shields. Okay, so that's... Well, if your Death Rattle Silence, yeah, so then that's actually a really good play here. Because he's playing Death Rattle Hunter. So if you use a Terra Scale Stalker this turn, and play dead, this won't trigger, right? It's just a dead a dead card. You could turn uh, coin into a carnivorous cube and swallow it. You don't get the effect. Good Piper. I see that before. Uh I'm going to hit Go that and then heal my minion. But I pulled my two combo cards that I didn't want to pull. That's lovely. I then think, if uh, he Carnivorous Cubes this card, I'm going to kill my Radiant Elemental, I'm going to let him live, I'm going to let him generate, um, beast will not be no, tamed. he's still not doing it. What is he doing here? Does he not have a cube? Can hit my face, I guess? I'm actually very, very confused. I don't know what he's doing. This is Death Rattle Hunter or is this Minion Hunter? Um, if this can survive, it turns seven cloning galleries really nice. We shall see. Uh, the one card I think that would kill this right now would be either Flanking Strike or even if he buffs this with a Crackling Razor Maw. But either way, I'll have a turn 7 play, which is putting on Velen or Cloning Gallery. Cloning Gallery is more optimal. <laughs> yeah. oh, that's cool. That means I have Velen put out this turn. I have Velen, and then I have Charged Devil Sword next turn. Good. Eight mana. Where's my cat? Yeah, that that's your play. Okay. I'm gonna start hitting space. Because I have Boning Gallery. To pull out um spell buff card. I am Macedon. I'm not scared of that card. The taunt. Taunt gonna do to me. Doesn't seem like he has a turn five play or a five mana play. Oh no, Stonehill Defender, whatever shall I do? I actually think Malagos might be my play here. Actually, I don't have Resurrect. I'm gonna play these cards. Just so I can add it onto my uh, Lust Diamond Spellstone charge. He's gonna kill these. I mean, he's probably gonna summon more minions, then I can uh, Psychic Scream them. Just fine. A nine mana card to get nine mana mm. copies. Nine mana worth of copies. Not bad.
Probably gonna tank and six damage to the face, depending on what he wants to do here. But it's fine. I'm not doing this to um preserve my HP really. I'm doing this to get more summon target. Your soul to me. Quickly. Testing. That's fine. Perfectly fine. The one problem is, is that I'm losing Painted Zealot. Seven damage. Fourteen. I get Velen and Radiant Elemental here. I win. Hmm. Eight would be. This is fourteen damage. Eight would be sixteen damage. Kill me next turn. Quickly. I don't think so. But I'm not gonna live to regret it, I think. Actually, if I kill Misha off here, I can't sell it with the Divine Shield. I think I can add some good pressure here. They have two kill commands? How long can this He's playing pawns. How long can this go on? How long can this playing a lot of pawns. How long can this go on? So if I get six healed. Okay. We'll shuffle all of these. And we'll heal. He's not, he has six cards. Put more minions down. It'll be okay. But then I can Psychic Scream again. Banna High Main. What are you doing here? That card. Is that Crackling Razor Maw? Easy lethal, guys. That was just rough. I needed that because I might have died this turn if I, especially with Psychic Scream. So, um, that's pretty good. I think I'll do one more duel. Seeing that I'm almost rank 18. I always fluctuate between uh, 19 and 17. Um, just because I have a couple decks that I just play for fun. I have a Shuffle Mage that is not really optimal for climbing. Um, I run a Test Rogue with a little bit of a twist at Lillian Voss, even though Lillian Voss is gen just generally a bad card. Um, what else is there? The forest fights back. I have a Heal of Paladin, which that doesn't work at all. So, whatever. I don't mind. Hey! My perfect turn one hand. Or turn two, more so. Ooh, and Shadow Essence in turn six. I like that. Playing tempo, guys. Oh. Two power word shields. I got a free 2-7 on board. 
I also noticed that my webcam kind of covering my name. Let me move that up. We'll keep that in mind for the next recording. But yeah, like, I've always wanted to record this game a little more. Um, I haven't done it because I've been so busy with my streaming. Uh, Twitch.tv slash Panthex. King Panthex. Twitch.tv slash King Panthex. Um, but, oh, wait. he's giving me cards? I hope he's ready for this. I mean, man, I mean. Not the best card that I wanted to put out, but better than I than anything really. To my core. So he's just wasting turn on that. That's fine. Let me see what I can do here though. Hold vivid nightmare. And also silence all minions and draw a card. But I don't want to draw actually. For the I have a nightmare would be good because I'll be able to clone and gallery this turn coming and then start um, running my combo chain. He's moving really slow and I've got a really good pace. He could kill this with uh, swipe, naturalize. He could do an 8 mana card. You can do Primordial Drake. Nothing? Ah, Velen, you came out the wrong time. For the sky. Ah. Now he goes to get pulled here. Darn. It's a shame. It's okay. I still have, um... I'm mad about that. He's running out of value. I still have a lot of value. Uh, Naturalize would be his optimal play because I'm going to put out Prophet Velen now and pressure him. Otherwise, he just needs he just needs to start drawing more cards because I'm starting to put a lot of pressure on this guy. Branching paths? Draw a card. Yeah, that's what he's gonna do. He needs to tell him to reduce a hit. Fine. Take away that. But he doesn't actually have anything to sustain himself on board. I have that. Vivid Nightmare, that's fine. Let's resurrect three. And put pressure to his face. Because if I can revive Velen next turn, I think I win. With Vivid Nightmare and then Tainted Zealot. This is why I like Charge Devil Soar um, as a part of my kit, because if I don't revive uh, a key minion, uh, such as Velen or Maligos, at least in my generation, I have another now big minion. About... I'm gonna have Radiant Elemental, which is such a good card. Love it. That's so well for me. I can't, I'm gonna be really upset when Zangoro rotates out. Because that card is so good in so many combos. I might now just play more wild about... once Radiant Elemental's gone. But I'm sure, like, they'll have something to substitute. Uh, with the new expansions. There's always something that blows my mind with uh, Hearthstone. I mean, hell. The boom ship for Warrior. That's insane. Not played as often as I as I expected it when it got short. announced, but... Let's see. Did I rage quit or something? Oh. I'm so sorry, buddy. Nice. 
I'm oh. so sorry. OTK free stack. Thank you very much. Three wins in a row. I got lucky. Um, these players were pretty unlucky with their plays. The first duel against the um, the Paladin was the, was the toughest. Because he put a lot of pressure on me. And pressure is something that counters this deck. Um, if I don't... I didn't actually... I drew one Spirit Lash in three duels, I think. Um, if I don't have Spirit Lash, I'm going to be screwed against aggro. But the aggro wasn't enough uh, for these three decks. But... Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, I might show more of that next stream, but another uh, next recording that is not stream, unless you guys want to stop by my Hearthstone streams whenever I do play. Um, and the next deck I want to show you guys is my token deck. It's uh, with the... Let me show you guys. I'll preview the, the deck for you right now. Nope, oh, that's my Evolve deck. Token. So it focuses on the Stormbringer. Transform your minions into random legendary minions. And it's a token deck, basically. So I focus with uh, Grim Necromancer. I have Feral Spirit. I have Volatic Burst. Um, if they're not playing, being played early to counter aggro, I'll actually like play it on turn 8 or 9. Get two tokens, two or four tokens, and then get two, four legendary minions for free. I get that as basically... Um, like a buffer card. Also, more uh, spell generation for this game. Corridor Creeper. Um, early game push with unstable evolution because I don't know, like a turn forced um Corridor Creeper uh at zero mana plus evolving this into a ten mana legendary Deathwing is pretty nice on turn four or five, uh, depending on the situation. But yeah, that that's pretty much it. For this stream. I'm glad you guys uh, were able to look at my uh, start small deck. Uh, if you have any suggestions, I know there's some other variations of this, uh, which includes Gilded Gargoyle, um, which is a really good card um, for this deck. Add a coin to your hand, so it helps with spell generation for uh, Lyra, it helps with um, Derek's cloning gallery combos, which is understandable. But, for this deck, I like to charge Devil Soar a lot, because, once again, when it spreads, when I can resurrect and then Vivid Nightmare, I can get free 7 to 14 to even 21 damage um, out on board, depending on the combo that I'm running. Um, Maligos actually didn't do me justice this, this time, even though it's a good card to have, because uh, it does do a good combo with Brelin, but Maligos was pulled pretty early. Um, but the the key player he was my prophet Velen for these two, and that was pretty good. So yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate your time for this video. If you liked it, please leave a like below. If you like my channel, um, which is still in the works, I I, I stream more on Twitch TV, so um, that's where I'm at at the moment. But if you want to see more of this, uh, leaving likes below. Uh, even just viewing this video is good enough for me. Um, share it if you'd like. And feel free to stop by and say hi when I stream on Twitch. I'll let you guys know through Twitter. If you guys want to join my Discord, I'll post the link of that below in the comments too. And my Twitter is also going to be in the comments too. So thank you for stopping by, and I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Adios.